What's up guys? Today I'm going to be teaching you how to cut down on a video's size but keep your quality. And as you can see right now I'm on Mac. Um, the, the product that I'm going to be showing you is you can use it for anything. But right now I want to talk specifically for Mac. If you want to cut down a raw file, the easiest way without downloading something would be to put it in iMovie. Um, it takes two gigabyte movies and it puts them down to like uh, 500 megabytes, which is substantially less. Okay, so anyways, for the rest of you guys um, who want to be doing that, but, you know, keeping the same quality, because putting in iMovie will cut down quality, the easiest way to do it is using this product right here called Handbrake. Now, Handbrake is extremely easy to use. You can go download it. I'll put a link down in the, in the description, um, but you could probably just find it on Google really, really easily. Now, as you can see, you can do uh, video codecs you want. Um, H2 uh, 8.264 or you can do you know MPEG whatever you want um, you want constant quality and I, I you know I sometimes I drag them up like this just um, to keep it you know so it doesn't um, lag or do anything like that um, you know you can add chapters and stuff like that I mean this is all pretty just easy to use I, I, I mostly don't mess with this stuff so let's see here you go up to here to source and you find what you want to use right now I'm going to be using this Sonic Generations part and as you can see that part is 3.92 gigabytes which is way too much for um, YouTube and once you have that it'll show up right here as your file source um, whereas you, you can uh, yeah, here's where you save it at. You you click browse and it'll and you click where you want to save it to. I usually just do uh, desktop and then organize it later. And then you just click start, and then it starts down here. It doesn't take too long either, which is kind of nice. Um, yeah, as you can see, the ETA is three minutes, so I'm just gonna let it load for a bit or let it go. <laughs> Alright, so there we go. The video has been downloaded. Um, and as you can see, it showed up right here. And uh, by the way, I just want to say that you can do anything. Uh, it doesn't slow down your computer very much. It doesn't slow down your internet or do anything like that. So you can uh, do other stuff while you're doing this. I just didn't because I didn't want to. Um, as you can see, this is the original, still 3.29 gigabytes, or 92. And this is the other one which is two, 258.8 megabytes which is an extremely big drop considering um, you want these on YouTube so now I'm going to show you the quality so here I'm going to open this one with QuickTime if it'll let me, QuickTime and I'll open this same one with QuickTime I'm going to put them side by side to each other So even work <laughs> really really badly done but anyways here's the original I'm gonna move this here's the original and here's the newer one hello hey. welcome back to part 12 of Sonic Generations this time we skipped the really crappy level and went to a really good one and the video's working this time dun 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 yay Yep, and this is a... So as you can see, the video has not lost any sort of quality or anything. And it, you know, still looks good. And most importantly, it's less um, space. It takes up less space. So this makes it really easy to upload videos to YouTube that are under that sort of space limit without losing any quality. So thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you guys in another video, and see you later.